Welcome to 2230. The restoration of train services on the East West Line, EWL, in Singapore has been delayed again, this time to the 1st of October, following a series of setbacks. Initially, the authorities planned to restore full service between Jurong East and Buna Vista MRT stations by the 30th of September. This stretch of the line, which includes the Clementi and Dover stations, has been without train service since the morning of the 25th of September when a disruption caused significant damage to various rail segments and equipment. On 28 September, SMRT, together with engineers from the Land Transport Authority, LTA, announced that they had completed the restoration of all damaged rails. Additionally, critical infrastructure, including the power-supplying third rail and point machines, had either been repaired or replaced. With this progress, SMRT dedicated the 29th of September to conducting safety tests to ensure the line could safely reopen for commuters. However, during these tests, engineers made an unexpected and concerning discovery. As they ran stress tests using locomotives and performed endurance tests with passenger trains loaded with bags to simulate real conditions, they identified 12 new cracks on unreplaced rail segments. These cracks had not been visible before but became evident only during the testing process. According to LTA and the transport minister, Chi Hong Tat, these cracks were likely caused by the damaged train that had disrupted the EWL on 25 September. Though the cracks were not initially visible, the safety tests revealed that the rail segments had been weakened and were no longer safe for use. As a result, SMRT and LTA are now working to replace an additional 10 rail segments, which is expected to be completed by tonight. Following this, further safety tests will be conducted throughout the 30th of September to ensure the line can resume operations on the new target date of the 1st of October. Minister Chi also noted that the new planned restoration date of the 1st of October remains subject to weather conditions, as rain or storms could impact the repair process or testing phases. Commuters and residents in the affected areas will have to wait until then to know whether services will finally resume on the busy stretch of the east-west line. What do you think about the repeated delays in restoring train services on the east-west line? Do you believe more could have been done to prevent the cracks from being discovered at the last minute? Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below. If you found this report informative, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to 2230 for more detailed coverage of Singapore's transport news. And hit the notification bell so you won't miss our latest updates. Stay tuned for more news, and we'll see you in the next one. Thinking question, how do you think public transport operators in Singapore should handle safety testing and repairs to avoid last-minute delays? Could additional measures improve the efficiency of such large-scale repairs?